right, I'll say it for you. If our roles were reversed, and I hurt Chao Jin, you would execute me. If you don't, Yang Xu and Ding Yi will murder me one day. No matter what Chao Jin has done to me, I will never hurt him. The moment I went into that cell, I knew that you had complete power over what would happen to me. I knew that my father would be impartial to me. Wonderful! Now you're negotiating with me. That's my son. You should be fearless. Good! Very good. Now I need to think about whether there's anything. I have to negotiate with you. Good! <laughs> My king, Sima Yi was drunk in Chu Yan's jail. They were drinking together. Uh, bring Sima Yi. What a lord. What a king. Anyone, get water to bore on him. Stop. Right, you know. What a lord. What a king. <laughs> Never mind. Leave him alone. I wait here. Bring me some more wine. Yes, sir. Drop it. Help he. Your medicine's ready for you now. Not now. I don't want it. Please take it, or it'll cool down. <coughs> Tell P. Cao Ji is both kind and caring. You know that is true. He wouldn't do such a thing. I don't know why Tsui Yan said that. So in your opinion, is Cao Ji always the good guy? And me? What about me? I've always thought... You're kind-hearted. Cao Pi. Don't be angry with Cao Ji. You mustn't hate your own brother. Could you bear to watch your brother lose his own life? You know that a conspirator will be sentenced to death. I believe they will find out the truth. The conspirators will be punished. Don't worry too much. Hmm?
you awake? Sorry. Forgive me. Forgive... For, forgive me, my king. If you want a drink, why don't you join Sarpi's celebration? What I did was unforgivable. Please don't make fun of me, my king. After getting drunk, you're quite sober now. Come, let's have a drink. No, 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 thank you. Only you and I are here. You do not need to worry too much. Go ahead. Were you involved in Sui Yang and Shun Yu's plan? Sir, I'll tell you everything. When I heard that Mr. Shun had died, I went to condemn Minister Tsui. But I was eventually moved by what he said. Minister Tsui has devoted his life in service of Wei. You still address him with the title of minister? In your opinion, is he treacherous or is he loyal? I think Sui Yan and Shun Yu are dedicated to Wei, to the people, and to your ambitions. They are the only ones who dare stand up to you. When you're wrong, they're both loyal to you. You say loyal? Dare stand up to me. Do you think it's loyal to force me to kill my youngest son? Please calm down. You know Cao Ji. He will be fine. It's just that he won't... Won't be the successor anymore. I didn't say that. I dare not. You are an erudite man, aren't you? You know a thing or two about our history. You must know what happens to someone who loses the fight for succession. So don't try to fool me. Sima Yi, don't try to manipulate me. It won't end well. My king, I also have two sons. I understand how hard it must be for you to see the future of your son ruined for the sake of the country. You are an incredibly powerful king who can make the world change in any way that you want to, just like Emperor Huan and Yuan Shao and Yuan Shu. But you are different. You would rather change yourself for the good of the nation you care about. You're a real hero. Cao Pi has the same ambitions as you do. But he tries to hold back that side to him. But if allowed, he would become great. You wouldn't need to worry about Cao Ji. <laughs> How do you know I am different from the emperors Huan and Ling, Yuan Shu and Yuan Shao? Because you said that Yuan Shao looks strong on the outside, but is weak inside. He hesitates to decide. He's not prepared to give his life for the greater cause. Mm. 
<laughs> and what makes you so sure that Cao Pi is going to be the true successor? I don't know. I'm not sure. You certainly are right about one thing. I'm willing to change for the good of the nation. I've always expected one of my sons to change themselves for the nation and be stronger than me so that he can protect the nation in peace. One of them will rise up and become the new king. Sao Ji. As for Sao Pi, can you help him to become that king? Sao Pi has inherited your wisdom and your military talents. Even if I didn't do anything, he still wouldn't disappoint you. <laughs> you really have a way with words. It's a pity. I've been thinking that. It's a pity that Sun Yu chose to sacrifice himself. I'm a guilty man. I'm at your disposal. You're at my disposal? How sure are you of that, huh? Someone told me that you work for him. I shall remind you that Sao Pi is more ruthless than I could ever hope to be. I wish you good luck. The king has put all of Marquis Pingyan's officials into jail. Why did he do that? He clearly did it for you. If they all decide to fight back, your brother will find himself in a whole heap of trouble. Yang Zhu is using your brother for his own benefit. You told me that Chao Pi was saying that your brother would be safe. Now that Chao Pi has had his name restored, your brother still finds himself in prison. Father. I'll save my brother. How? Huh? Will the king really listen to you and release him? <sighs> Father, you are right. The king did this for me. <sighs> He's busy pushing me. To plead with Cao Pi. Plead with Cao Pi? Why? Cao Pi has a great advantage. The king cannot force him to do anything he doesn't want to. But Cao Ji isn't willing to give up so easily. So, he uses our brother to force me to let Cao Pi make a concession. Only if Cao Pi lets go of Cao Ji, will the king Let go of our brother. A concession? If he makes a concession, won't that prevent him from becoming the heir? He has gone through hell trying to get to this position. There's no way he'll simply give it up for our brother. Chabi's temper has a reputation. If you get on his bad side, you're placing your life at risk. I'm not prepared to lose two sons this way. Father, it's the only way to save him. I have to give this a try, no matter how hard it seems.
Uh, uh, hey, brother, hey. Where, you... where are you going at this late hour? Would you ever get some sleep? Master, Master, now is the best time. Why do you think so? I believe that Sima Yi is going to pull this off. <sighs> Tell me why. Because if he goes at daytime, he'll attract attention. But if he goes at night, he can take time to persuade Chao Bi until he's tired enough and is forced to accept this request. Cook your medicine. The medicine's ready. <sighs> I know what you want to say. I don't want to hear it. Go back. I just want to save my brother. Please, understand me. Stand up. Please, I'm begging you. Let them both go. Let go of Cao Ji and Yang Xiu. That's the only way. The king will let go of my brother. How do I do that? Tell me, how do I let go of them? If I keep quiet, my father will definitely punish both of them. And I'll become the next heir, right? Yes, sir. What's more, Jun Yu and Chui Yan have dedicated their lives to me. They are placing their lives on the line. You're the one who told me not to disappoint the two of them. Yes. So explain to me how to let go. I know that as your supporter, I shouldn't bother you. But this is about my brother's life. Please understand my difficulty. Otherwise, I wouldn't be here. What if I don't want to understand? I want to go to jail for my brother. Simi. Who do you think you are coming here like this? Do you think you can freely choose to go to jail or not? I'm just one step away from becoming the heir. Just one step away. But you force me to give it all up. <sighs> you can't put this on me now. My master, I'll always be your most loyal servant. I know the difficulties that you've had. But I have to fulfill the responsibility to my family. I still remember the, the story told me when you were in trouble. You said that your brother Cao An pushed you up on the back of the horse and told you to run away. And then he was shot by arrows. Sir, Vice Prime Minister, you told me in tears that you would rather exchange your life with your brothers. Now I feel the same. I'm feeling Like you did when you, when you were that little boy. I, I'm begging you, please, please, please accept my request. Please, I beg. Please.
Sao Pi, here is your medicine. Pi, I saw Brother Yi kneeling outside. I am afraid... Afraid of what? I didn't ask him to do that, did I? What do you think I can do? Do you think I should save Simalan? I remember an old saying that a follower will repay his master for his kindness. Will the master repay the follower? I almost forgot. You're a member of the Sima family. <sighs> Although I am a Sima, please don't think of me this way. Stand up. Are you also trying to force me? I understand your situation. Take it. Tell P. Brother. Why are you here? Father said even if we're all in danger, we must still save our brother. Good. I'm Sima Fu. I'm here to join you. I want to follow and assist you. My brother and I will share our lives with you. We will die for you. We pledge both our lives to you. I mean it when I say that the whole Seema family will dedicate ourselves to supporting you. Please save my brother. What's wrong with you? Your hair has turned grey. You look a little cold. You know, 
You can be strangers to some people that you're familiar with until their death. Although I'm used to the indifference between most people. I don't want our relationship to be like that. I want to kill Yang Zhu right now and become the heir. But I'm tired. I can't stand to fight with Chao Zhi and my father for another round. I've been thinking about it the whole night. Even if I got the position, by disobeying my father and losing you, how would I manage to keep it? I don't know. Please. Forgive. Me. Although I am older than you, I always feel like you're my big brother. Every time I'm with you. From now on, my brother and I will dedicate our lives to you. Please stand up. Brother, please stand up. Careful. Come inside and get warm. <laughs> Greetings, father. Greetings, mother. Zhao Pi, why are you here on such a cold day? How's your wound doing? Are you feeling better? Don't worry, Mother. It's not a big deal for me. Why'd you come here?
Brother. <laughs> Congratulations, my master. I know that everything is under control. What did you say? I know that everything's under control. Oh. Yes, brother. What are you doing here? Why are you cooking here? Huh. Lang had a hard time in jail. I want to cook something for him, to help him recover. Fool, isn't it enjoyable? If you read books and study poetry, are you sure you want to follow Cao Pi? If a person can, he should give his life to the government. Besides, how many scholars dream of having that position? Fool, Lang just came out of jail. He still finds himself in a precarious situation. I really don't want you to be involved in all of this. I want to help. By your side. I want to be standing next to you. I trust the person you and Zhao chose. You won't choose a fatuous master. I know. It's a tough environment. Even you struggle. But I don't want to leave you alone. I don't expect to do anything great. I just want to stand together with you, with Lang and the whole family. When they're in trouble, that's all I want to do. Food. <gasps> Look, you should think about this. Think about yourself. You know you're a careless person. Are you sensitive enough to be an official? <laughs> Are you teaching him again? Bro, come, sit here. Take a seat. Do you remember how many bowls you broke in the kitchen when you were young? Father, 
chased you a long way to beat you. Exactly. <laughs> Brother, I'm saying that Fu should not get involved with any of the courts. Listen here, a good official must also be a good actor. If your brother hadn't cried in front of Dong Zhuo, our family would have been in great trouble. Can you cry when you want? You can only cry when you're sad. Can you cry when you want? Lung cried for the safety of the whole family, but I can cry really hard for my personal gains and losses in front of my enemy whenever I want. No, you can't. Look at his pure eyes. Can he be an official? <laughs> <laughs> Yee. I think it's okay, what Pooh wants to do. If one day a war comes, we can fight together. I'll take the lead, to force them to surrender. I think the three of us would be great together. I think he's right. We'd be unbeatable if we fought together. Come, come. I want you to imagine mm. that we're standing in front mm. of an enemy. When they start the attack, we'll be frightened to death. You start to cry, and you start to cry too. There. And that's how we'd win, see? Through our tears. <laughs> <laughs> You're really something. He's just making fun of me. <laughs> Here huh? you are. Let's stop now. Let me have a taste. It looks really good. <laughs> Is it good? You forgot salt. I added it. Let me. It's too salty. Too salty. Brother, did you lose your sense of taste in jail? Still nothing. <laughs> That's weird. Here, let me. Brother! 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 Master! Brother! Wake up! Hey! Hey! Brother! Doctor, how is he? Sima, let's talk outside. Father, please stay here. You're talking about my son. Just talk here. I have to tell you the truth. He has an incredibly high fever. There are blood stains on his neck. I think he may have the plague. <sighs> it's common in the town at the moment. Many, many people have caught the plague. Chen Lin and Wang San both died of it. There's no cure at the moment. <gasps> Father! I'm afraid that there's nothing more I can do. You should prepare yourselves for his death. Thank you, Doctor. I'm okay. sorry. Father! Stop her! Father! Come here, don't go father! there. Father! Oh, Who stop our father? No, no. Father! Father! I'm sorry, my boy. I should never let you get involved in the fight between Xiao Pi and Xiao Xi. No, it's my fault. It's me. It's me. You should take all the blame for this. Father, oh, please calm down. He's still alive at the moment. We can invite good doctors to come and see him. Hoji. Sir. Go to the market and buy what's called wormwood. Burn it to smoke the whole house out. Use hot water to wash all of our clothes. And make sure no one enters his room. If we're all gone, who will take care of my father? I'll do it. Brother, this I'll do enough. it. I'm strong. Don't fight anymore. I'm the oldest here. I'm not afraid of death. You should all go home. I'll stay. Father. I don't want to see you get sick anymore. Father. Listen to me. Who can prove that I drank from the same bowl that he drank from? So I have to be separated from him. Hoji. Sir. Please leave the food for Lung and me in the court. I'll pick it up every day. Simai, what if you also get sick? Both life and death are decreed by fate. Maybe we're meant to die. Tell Shu and Zhao not to come up here. Take care of Ming Ding. Her mother died early. We must be calm in front of her. Me. Father, do as I say. Father, listen to Yi. 